Hey, what's going on guys? Pog here and welcome to my Minecraft Let's Play. This is episode number 219 and let's get on with the shoutout for today. So the shoutout for this episode goes to KetXDSmith who went and left the comment saying, I miss this Let's Play series. Love you, Pog, and keep up the great work. Well, thanks so much KetXD for writing this. I want to go ahead and welcome you to the beautiful world as well to the Diamond Shoutout Room. Alright, so last episode didn't go as well because I... I obviously decided to fall in love a lot. Um, so as you can see now I'm more prepared. We got potion of fire resistance. I also have a compass with me. So that in case I'm lost I should be good. Because you see I have to be super safe. Um, I've got the ultimate pickaxe with me. And this has fortune 3, efficiency 4 and unbreaking 3 with a mending as well. So it means that every time it goes ahead and repairs the pickaxe itself. Um... And so the pickaxe pretty much never breaks as long as you're getting experience levels uh, while holding the tool. So I was thinking that I should go ahead and uh, I'm not exactly sure which way to go. But I'm thinking maybe I should take the rail system like some further away or something like that. And I don't know if you guys can tell but I also have this over here which is... Um, all the rail systems that go from building to building. So we got the one that goes to the tree farm, the one that goes to the blue farm, um, or technically the blue tower, and then um, also the one that goes to the castle, which is under there. And that's that's actually one of the reasons why I built the underwater uh, minecart system because of the inspiration that I had uh, from this example. So I'm just gonna go into the minecart station, which is obviously this glass building right here, and I'm just gonna go ahead and. Um, just head down here until I find the minecart, because I remember last time we were here, the minecart actually went down without me even being in it. And hopefully, um, we can just get in and go over to a place that could be a cave nearby. And I think this would just be the easiest way to go there, because it won't be that difficult, um, because we can easily find my way back, and at the same time, it's going to take me next further away. Um, I know I have a mob spawner, if you guys don't know, I think that behind that tree right there, that's a zombie mob spawner. So it's not just that, and I can see my world fading away from me, or I'm actually fading away from the world technically because I'm the one moving. But yeah, there was that cobblestone part right here that technically is, um, oh no, uh, no, 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 no. Where's my pickaxe? Oh god. I just I just decided to press B at it. I, I was thinking to get out to go here, which I think I should. Um Okay, uh Guys that scared me. I thought there goes my pickaxe. But yeah, so this is where we're gonna go. And uh hopefully this is deep enough cave. Oh hello, hello, hello. And here's what you can do. If your tool was damaged, you could just switch um and when you're getting the experience levels it could just get your tool can get it instead. So we're just going to eat this. And then let's put a torch. I'm actually going to get all this stuff this time. Why not? I mean, I was still getting it before, but yeah, I'll get it much more now. Um, give me that. I can definitely feel some difference in speed comparing to the diamond efficiency 5 versus this efficiency 4 iron. But it's not that big of a difference. And I don't know if you guys could tell, but the tool is now repaired. I don't. I think it would have been damaged while I was getting all that. But look, if I do this, see how it's it's that. But then it repairs. But here's the thing: if your tool is nicely repaired, you're get, getting experience as well. If your tool is not repaired, you're not getting experience. So let me show you what I mean. If I go ahead and break it, now look at the XP bar example. Well, I guess because my tool was fixed. I don't know. It's It just seems like you get less experience if you're using mending tool and it needs to be repaired. Uh, would you guys think that way? Let me know in the comments below. I um, should probably put a torch. I don't know why I do this, you guys. I always get the coal or whatever it is, and then I go ahead and put the torch after. Like, once I already got it. Okay, there's just so many coal in here. But at least we got the fortune pickaxe, which is just insane when it comes to coal. Um... You can get so many. Oh yeah, and then lapis lazuli. You can get so many lapis lazuli because of the coal. Uh, I mean, sorry, because of the fortune uh, three enchantment. And there it is. So now we got, I don't even know how many, but I'm going to say I have almost three stacks of coal. Whoa. Almost, almost. I thought for a second I had more than three. 
because I looked at this and I thought I might have one in my actual inventory buyer because um, I forgot that it's full. But still pretty good. Um, no, don't be at that end. Come on. Oh my god, we're here for gold. Where is the gold? Oh, let me get this real quick. We need the gold so we can finish that power rails. This is a gold week, not a coal week. I mean, I don't know. Coal week would sound pretty cool, especially if you guys could guess how many coal I would find, which would be very hard to guess because there's just so many coal. But at the same time, um, how many gold do you guys think I can find in this in this cave week? Uh, technically, gold week, cave week, I don't know. But yeah, gold is what we're here for mainly, and give a guess how many gold we will find in total. Uh, because uh, we can just add up all the gold that I had at the end of the episodes. And then we can see how many gold I had. Oh, hello. Um, I don't think the witch can get me. Can it poison itself? Um, I have to go there, but I don't know how to do it without being... Oh, it's only slowness. Oh, whoa. Okay. I'm already poisoned. I can't change anything. Um, it's only slowness. Let me just go f much closer. Let me just go closer. Oh, guys, I missed this so much. How you could see when the potion effects are going to go up. How many seconds left, example. I really missed that. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is... I'm just going to go ahead and build a water collector here. So that I don't have to deal with this. Being like this, pretty much. I should say. Uh... Well, technically, I don't know if I could do it because it's still going to come from the other side, I should say. But I guess I'll just block it off like this. Now we don't have to deal with that annoying water. Okay, so let's do this. Very, very nice. Alright, there's the creeper, I guess, that I had to deal with. I'm just going to ignore the coal now, you guys. I don't think I should um, spend too much time getting the coal. Because, again, we're here to get gold, and I do have a lot of coal, as far as I know, unless I used them. But I don't think I might have used all of it. Okay, this cave, I feel like we can come here and visit this cave multiple times. I mean, this thing is large, which is good, which is very, very good. Um, okay, so apparently I've been here before, actually. Um, I would assume that if there was a gold, I have already taken it. Because if I visited here and I saw gold, I would have taken it. But I don't think I visited here. Because this one is... Oh my god, this place is huge. We need gold. Hello? Zombie, show me where the gold is. I mean, I know... I know the zombie pigments could drop gold. I think we should go to the nether one day. And then just fight zombie pigments. Because they... Oh my gosh! Okay, I'm dead. Uh, I just got triple teamed by skeleton arrows. Uh, uh oh. Guys, I'm dead. I'm gonna die if I don't get out of here. Oh my god. Uh, uh, that was crazy. I cannot wait. Whoa! Oh, whoa! Okay, okay, okay. Back off, back off. I was like, where am I getting here from? Oh, wow. Whew. Okay, I'm alive. For now. For now. For now. Okay, here we go. Um, Just gotta eat. I guess I don't have enough food. But it is time for me to say... They just fight at each other. I think they destroyed each other or something. Oh, maybe this one was hurting me the most. But there it is. There it is. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, come on. Yes. Beautiful. It's nice how they fight at each other. Because I feel like they damaged each other as well. Okay, guys. Gold. Yes, I found gold. I found gold. Good. All right. Uh, no creeper, seems like. And here we go. Let's drop down here. Okay. I won't be surprised if this is part of my strip mine. Because we're not that far away and that strip mine goes for quite some distance. And because we're also not near lava much, I'm not going to drink the fire resistance potion. Because I don't see a reason to waste it if I don't need it. Um, I'd say let's go down here more. And I should eat. Oh, emerald. Hello. How many will I get? Not bad. Better than one. And more emerald. Great. Okay. Let's take that. Oh, three on that one. That's pretty good. 
So, don't you guys like mending? I think mending enchantment is, is very, very good. It's like you never have to worry about your pickaxe breaking, especially if you're here. Oh, silverfish, isn't it? Okay, so let's see how many lapis lazuli I can get. It's 12 from that one. Look at that, 32, you guys, in total now. That's insane. And there we go. So we have 39. I think I only mined three blocks of lapis lazuli, and I got 39. That's insane. All right, so if we don't have that much gold, I'd like to get at least 20 or something. Where'd you come from? Sit down. All right. I know this is like, ooh, gold. I was like, I know this is the one that takes me to more like closer to my strip mine probably, but apparently not. Because there's gold in here. Beautiful. Great. I almost missed that one. 29 pieces already. Okay. I guess my goal was 30, but I'm going to probably pass it by the time we're done here, maybe. Uh, we're dead end. It's so hard not to take all this, to be honest. It's like, it's so tempting to do it. Like, it's so tempting to take all this. And there it is. There's that too. Which is, which is pretty good. And then I have to get all this iron. Okay. And... I'm not exactly sure where all those crazy skeletons were. I mean, I think they were here. But, like, where was the part that I, I was like, I probably have strip mined around there. And look, now I don't think I'll get experience levels. See? See that? I'm breaking all that, but the experience levels are repairing the tool now I'm getting it. So yeah, you don't get experience levels, it seems like, if your tool is being repaired. Because the experience levels are going towards your tool and not towards your level. Um, which uh, which I don't care much. But I always thought that you kind of get both, but you don't. At least it seems like it. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Um, so here we are, I guess. I have no idea where we are, but let's see. Uh... Okay, so nothing much here. And then... I think I should just be smart and just block this part off. With like a saying, hey, let's not go here. It's all... It's all been explored there, so I don't get lost. Um, where else? Well, let's kind of get out of here. Maybe there might be something else around. Because this part... I feel like I kind of took everything, except coal, maybe, and iron. Imagine if I miss diamonds, because that won't be cool, but, uh, yeah, it seems like there's a torch around here, but I felt like I should go here. Definitely, I should explore around here, because it doesn't seem like I've been here. Well, first things first, let's get the siren. Okay, I know that zombie's coming towards me, but I think that's fine. Maybe not fine. Oh, whoa! Did not see you have a shovel there. Okay. There we go. Very, very good. And then we'll just forget about the coal for now. As I said that I mined coal. That's funny. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. What am I doing? Did I just try to jump into a ravine? How smart can I be, possibly? Um. So apparently I've been around there, though. So it won't make sense to go there, because I probably took the gold already. There's some iron around here. Ah, where's that? I need to get 30 gold, like, that's my goal. 30 gold, come on. We can we can do it. Where is it? Where is the more gold? The, the remaining. Um, I don't want to run out of food, because if I run out of food, I have no choice. I have to get out of here. Because having full health in the, in a cave is important. Because you have to deal with all these creatures. And... Yes, I mean, this place is nice to explore a lot. But I have a lot of the other stuff. And I just want to only try getting the stuff that I truly need. I And it, it's so hard to ignore iron, though. Like, when you see one nearby like this... It's so hard to ignore it, so I just always tend to want to get it. Look at this. Do you see how many iron I just got? 
This is crazy. Oh my god, look at this. It's so hard to ignore it. Alright, so... How about here? Lava, I'm guessing? No? That one might be taking me up. I think this is how I... The place I came from? Maybe? Maybe, maybe. Um... I'm not sure, but it doesn't seem like I'm gonna find any here. Um... Okay, I got an idea. I'm just gonna eat, then jump into that water. Here we go. Ready? Oof, I did it. Okay. And then... Just kind of look above and see if I see any gold. I don't think I do. Oh, there we go. Found it. Uh, so apparently I've been here, or maybe I haven't been in this part because there wasn't any torch or light source. Um, but I've been around there. But how could I not take the torch? I mean, sorry, the gold. That's surprising. Okay, I got an idea now because I, I've got all the stuff that I wanted. I think what I need to do is go behind around there and then just kind of build my way up. I've got that tiny bit of lava around here. Oh, there could be more gold around here, actually. So I've been around here. Um, it's so hard to like avoid this, but definitely I've been around here and I most likely take in the gold if I sow it. Okay. What about down here? Ooh. Well, how about if I just go down there just to the strip mine? Because there's most likely the strip mine is around here. Yeah, this is taking me deeper, torch on the right will take me home, so. Oh wait, it's kind of, um, yeah, it's, it's kind of hard to tell. Because left and then right, yeah. Because look, if I'm, let me, let me demonstrate what I'm trying to say, um. Let's assume that this is what I do. Like, we're just mining around here. Well, it's gonna be this though. Okay, let's assume I was just mining here and we put torches around this way. Now, when I'm coming back, usually from these locations, I'm gonna be two blocks away and like this. So, I would have a torch to my left like this so now if I'm heading this way you can see now the torch is on my right where if I'm heading this way the torch is on my left now to find my way back I have to be lucky enough to be on this for the torch to be on my right am I making sense because I can't take that torch thing up in factor because I'm not sure but because this is the rail one which is the rail system um, that goes far I think I only went one direction and so if I went only this direction I can just put the torches on my left meaning I should be following it to my right so this should take me home I'm hoping I'm really really hoping <laughs> yeah I think it is I think this is gonna be take me home um, possibly yeah possibly I don't, I'm not yeah, there we go. It did. Oh yeah, I missed this. Look at look at this mine mine shaft. And the slime just took the rail. Did you guys see that? Okay, well. Thirty six pieces of gold, and we're back in this beautiful mine shaft. No, don't push me. Okay, time time to do that. Look at this mine shaft. This is this is great. And then I have to deal with the slime, apparently. Because I don't like it being here. 
And then we got this beautiful doors. Okay, there we go. I don't know what happened. I don't I don't see the other ones. Okay, well there was a lot of rails around here, and I mean my cards. Let's go ahead and get rid of them. Put them in there. Oh, I got a shoe from the zombie, I'm guessing. So, or skeleton, maybe. I don't know. What drops this stuff? Let me know in the comments below. But, hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, please leave a like. And also, subscribe to the channel. Check out my Polgado channel, which is my second channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.